This is South Park Fan Game Pack, guaranteed virus free. It should be interesting because we are playing this on Vine Sauce OS. Okay, now, really, what this is is actually Windows 98, and these games are old. They're from late 90s, early 2000s. Yes, some of these are going to be crusty. Some of these are going to be really stupid. And if you're not like into that kind of South Park humor, you don't have to like it. We're just taking a look at it. And here it is. Big Gay Al, a mysterious visitor to South Park, travels in a magical briefcase. He runs Big Gay Al's Big Gay Animal Sanctuary where he can take you Take the big gay boat ride and learn that being gay is all right. See? Positive messages from South Park. Now, what we have here are a number of different... I mean, this is the South Park theme. I guess this is something you could have downloaded in the late 90s. But um, you got arcade games and story games. Chat, some of these may not work. Some of these may be somewhat offensive in some areas. Be prepared for that such is the late 90s and especially late 90s South Park and fans making these I think it ended up getting filtered in a way that they're not overly fucked up maybe there's a couple little things but nothing too terrible but just be aware of these things so you know how do you want Kenny to die so oh so this is one of those things that and um, Matt and Trey ended up kind of moving away from because it got kind of boring but this was the big meme of the time. Such a nice day. That smells like teen spirit. Oh. Okay. Trying to figure out. This is just a low game of many games. I think this one's probably... Okay. And we were entertained for weeks by this! Cliff death. Ah, a beautiful view. Hey, what the hell, slippery moss. And we're getting smells like teen spirit again. <laughs> oh my god. Explosion. Hot naked Salma Hayek box. Okay. Please do not think my games will all be bad because of this. This game took just over five minutes to complete. All right, well, that should probably give you an example of what to expect. Mega Cartman? All right. I'm gonna make this louder. One day in the little town of South Park, he is the perfect asshole. I didn't read the rest of that. I thought he... <laughs> Now to activate his brain? They're putting a chip in Cartman's brain. Get you fat ass out of here, Cartman. I'm not fat. Oh, he's got the V chip. I remember that. Oh my god! They killed Kenny! You bastard! Two good graphics. Okay. So it's it's Stan and it's Kyle. <laughs> I think it's Mr. Mr. Hat as well. Oh my god. The fact that this show is still going too, like 
and how much it's changed, like, over the years, too. Like, this was even before Randy Marsh became a main character. This was, like, pretty much just... Yeah, Kick the Baby. Um, Cartman is fat. That was, like, every episode was that joke. You know how that is. Then Kenny dies. Mr. Slave was probably in here somewhere. Oh, God. So, yeah, you, you get hit once, and you're dead. Really, really awful noise, that is. I mean, you have to respect that people were making games on the most primitive game-making software possible, just because they wanted to share their, <laughs> their interests. But, um, oh god, is that difficult to play. Click and play. Well, there you go, now you know... Click and uh, play made it. Let's try, um... Metal Gear Park. Tactical espionage action. Metal Gear Park. <laughs> now let's just play. Wow. Didn't they move away from this song? because the melody was something else. This song was from 2. It's a copyright thing. It's based on a Russian song. Mm. Colin Joyce is probably in his 50s now. Yeah, you're probably not wrong. They used what they thought was public domain, but it wasn't. Shame. Such a good song. Hello, Stan. I'm Colonel Kyle, and I'm going to be your mission expert for this little ordeal. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. Hang on, chat, hang on. Yeah, we're gonna do this. Okay. You're in a secret terrorist base along the outskirts of Russia! You've been sent to find knowledge on the secret military weapon, Metal Gear! Metal Gear? I thought that was just a lie made up to scare the U.S. I'm afraid not! It seems the terrorist group Hanky Poo has acquired it! But we need proof! You need to first get to the surface! Well, how do I do that? There's an elevator in that north section of this warehouse! Use that to go up to the surface! I'll brief you further when you reach there! Over! Okay. Alright, how, how you doing everybody? It's me, Grape. No, 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 no. Oh, okay, we- okay. No, we're good. I think. No, we're not good anymore. How do I- I should have read the fucking tutorial. Okay. Well, that was easy.
No, no, don't do- no, don't do that. How do I- No, it's not that button. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, fuck. The game's a little crusty, but I'm impressed. I, too, am impressed by this. Kind of. I mean... Roblox sound effect? Well, I think we just found the origin of a Roblox effect, and it was not created by Tommy Tellerico. Allegedly! This looks good for the time. It does look good for the time. Oh, you don't even need to press the button. Yeah, it's pretty good! that you are in the right, right at the entrance to the base, but we have worried about blah, 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 blah. So we have found another entrance for you, a small ventilation shaft close to the cargo doors at the entrance. It's your only way in without being noticed. Okay, I'll do whatever I have to. Not worth it for the bit, chat. This is not worth... Nope. Not, not worth, worth it, it for, for the, the bit. bit. Um, oh, okay, I fucked up. I mean, the guards aren't much of a problem. They're annoying. And since they, like, just magnetically latch onto you, the kind of the, the best way to uh, avoid them, or the best way to deal with them is just punch them. You completed the Metal Gear Park demo. Coming late summer 2002. Chat, that was 22 years ago. What? Man. I wonder if that actually ever came out in some form. Park Wars Demo. Seinfeld? Park Wars. <laughs> the Little Menace. Okay. Oh man, I hope Watto was in this. Choose your destiny, fight or die? Oh. That's not the button it wanted me to press. There's always a bigger fish. Okay. Oh my god! They killed Kenny! Oh my god. Oh my god is right. Oof. I will have the name of the person that made this pack. I, I originally got a version of this pack from them. Oh my god. With, um... Like, fucking... Nearly a hundred fan games. Which, I was like, dude, that's just too much. Like, there's no way I'm gonna be able to play all these. Ah! Oh! And so they cut down the pack, and then they cut it down even more. So... But I'll I'll get the name of the person soon. Let's just keep trying to do this. I would I would love to see if Ooh yeah, brother, yeah. I wanna see if anyone is Watto. Chat. Who wants to bet that I'm going to have to have Kyle and Stan also go through the fish? 
Oh, good. Wait, that, huh? What? So wait, you go from the beginning of the movie to the end of the movie? Password was dual? There's no password screen. Yes, there is. I don't, what are you supposed to do? What are you supposed to do? <laughs> this is a great game! Oh, yes! Done. Can't do that anymore. I just can't. I tried. I couldn't do it. Paper Cartman demo. Some of these icons, I think, got misplaced, possibly. But Scream in South Park. Here's another series that's ongoing. Okay, children, all get in a line to enter the movie. <laughs> oh, Jerry O'Connell's in it. <laughs> There's no music or sound effects on this one. Oh my god, he killed Kenny. Oh. Well, that was quick. Kenny didn't really get a chance to live very long. He's just a child. What's your favorite scary movie? Solid Snake, is that you? Titanic. It was the big movie at the time. That's not scary. A joke incoming. Are you kidding? Leonardo DiCaprio, that scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Ugh, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> oh, this is brilliant. I guess you're just supposed to collect knives? Oh, this is really... This is something. Oh, God. This almost looks like it could have been an actual licensed Flash game from back in the day. I think um, there will be a licensed South Park pack in the future as well. Does it end? Thankfully. Oh, you mean the game? Yeah, no. Uh, uh, no. We've seen enough. It's that good old reliable click and play again. South Park desktop themes. Screensaver, Mr. Hanky. This is official. Yep. Yeah. 
Man, screensavers. Okay. Okay. Boy, I need some of these. You need to sit in the corner until your flaming gas is under control. I need some of these screensavers on Windows 10. All right, children, take your seats. Uh, watch out, chat. It will be offensive, and then it's just completely tame. Just in case, chat member. It's just in case. That's it? It's just a cow? I didn't see a single alien. Um... Story games. South Park Live Alive? Like the game Live Alive. Okay. This is kind of weird to see something like this because Live Alive wasn't really very well known in America. I feel like it didn't really get its um, recognition until later. Penny will have to find a way to bring back economical success to the heaven if he wants to live. O okay. One day as Kenny was leaving school. Yeah, it's live alive. Kenny goes to heaven. Hello again, Kenny. I always know what you, what do you want. I already know what do you want, but there is a little problem. We are in a economical crisis, so this is the last time I can revive you. What, Kenny? You surely were the man that killed that man. The one that killed that man. There's a there's a password at least. Well, I have to fight Bar Brady, but there's n <laughs> uh Penny died. Game over. I tried, I pressed a bunch of buttons. But yeah, they use live alive music, so clearly there's something someone found that game and was like, I want to make a South Park fan game of it, but it had to do it in click and play. You know, good try, Super Mario Brothers 2, but South Park. <laughs> Vinny, Live Alive was one of the first games translated. Even so, like, I, I didn't know that, but thank you for that info, but, like... I didn't know that Live Alive was known at this time. I thought maybe people had discovered it, like, later. So, yeah, I guess... Yeah, it's kind of interesting. But yeah, this is more Lost Levels, or, yeah, Japanese Mario 2 than it is anything else. So, uh... Yep, it's just... Mario. So it's a crossover event chat. It's crusty Mario fan games, but, you know, South Park. Wow. It was fan translated in 2001. Well, there you go.
with Mario World death noises. So uh, again, non-standard Mario controls. I got this. Oh boy. Again, for its time, I appreciate what they were doing here. This must have been wild, because it's like- oh! Because <sighs> here you are, you know, in 2000. The year is 2000. And, uh, and you get to play Mario, but it's South Park. It controls a little bit like shit, but, you know. Um, uh, South Park Serial Killer demo. This one might get a little interesting. Very good sound effect. Wow. Yep. Doing a James Bond parody. Got it. Got it. The story. Text is going by a little quick. I didn't. What did that say? It went so quick. I didn't see. I looked at the chat. He stole all my dreidels? Why do we hang out with him? Hey, dude. <laughs> hey, ma'am. <laughs> of course, that line gets the most time, so you can read that. Oh my god! Yeah, this is back in the chef days. How's it going? Bad. I don't even want to read these lines out loud. I don't know why, I just, uh... They're assholes, my mom is a slut, uh, you know, the usual. That's why I don't want to read it out loud. <laughs> I don't want to go to hell. I heard you go to hell before you die if you say bad words. You know, already got banned on one streaming platform, so... Excellent. Okay, here we go. Really cool attack that does not even extend past Cartman's body. Okay, yeah. They're bullies though, chat. It said so. That's what it said there. So. Yep. Is that Butters? Oh yeah, it is Butters. I think this is kind of before Butters even became much of a thing. Or just at the beginning of that. Ski Free got kind of weird. Yeah, this is this is a little bit... This was kind of a thing. 
like this was a genre of flash game at the time. I don't know if you remember on Newgrounds Pico's Bad Day or whatever it was called. But yeah, this is certainly a type of game that was um, happening a whole lot at that time. Oh god, crackly. But it's also like... There are also people that took South Park into the edgiest possible direction. Holy shit. Not that it wasn't already really fucking edgy and insane in, you know, its original couple seasons. But, you know, I wouldn't be surprised if the fan games take it even a little bit further. Um, Stan Pet? Stan Pet. Okay. Application new. Your Stan is hungry. Stan thinks you're stupid. Vomit. Wendy. Vomit. Kyle. Stan thinks you're a dick. Food. It's it's uh, Tamagotchi, but it's Stan. So you just keep pressing the buttons until like okay so he's well fed he's full now he's bored <laughs> you know we, we we were easily amused at this time oh god Snap out of it, Stan. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, next. Final Park Adult. What is Final Park Adult? All right, start game. Oh, no, start game, start game. Okay, we saw the logo. We know it's a great logo, Kane X. I, I listen, I, he spent four days in Photoshop to get that logo. I actually made logos like that for people at this time. Final Park adult version. Why does this music sound familiar? Have you ever wondered about fate? Final Fantasy Tactics? Will you help me find the truth? Diablo font. Behold the very thing that makes this universe. The four crystals of light and the four crystals of- Why is this South Park? <laughs> If these crystals were ever disturbed, then the universe would be unbalanced. Uh, people lose their souls and gain new ones. Your world would not be the your world anymore, and that's what happened to a small town called South Park. O okay. Okay. I get it now. Red Eye Doom Expansion Pack. Is this a new game? In the game? GoldenEye was still pretty popular around now. Hey, Monty Python music! We were talking about this last week. The, um, well, this isn't technically Monty Python, it's it's a MIDI of the music that was royalty-free from the BBC archive that they used for the Monty Python Holy Grail movie that Neil Innes originally composed music for that they denied because it was too historically accurate and therefore did not fit the tone of the film. Final Fantasy IV music. The King of South Park.
Oh. Oh my god. It, literally, the name of the character is Cecil. Final Fantasy VII Mini. <laughs> this is amazing! Evasive maneuvers, everybody. Prepare to engage the enemy. Oh, someone got really into Final Fantasy, and they just wanted to share their... their interests in South Park form. It's... it's Ridley. Well, technically, it's not Ridley. It's... it's... Game over, yeah! No, that's just a pterodactyl. Never mind. Great battle. Onto South Park and step on it. <laughs> I mean, I'm gripped by this sword. <laughs> I, I'm an asshole, sir. What's your name? My full name is Craven Asshole, sir. How many assholes do I have on this ship? This is a Spaceballs joke. Great flying assholes. I mean, I'm just happy to hear the music, even if it is, like, midified versions of already midis, but, um... Again, someone was like, I really like Final Fantasy, and I really like South Park. So I'm gonna make my own game. I say game, but it's, you know... <clears throat> it's this. Bay Bay. <laughs> what is happening? Well, I don't know what's happening, chat. I do not understand. Is that is that Chef? King Love Baron? Did he see you? No, he didn't. I need him to lead troops. Oh, oh god. Oh god. Uh. Let's go to the South Park Castle. Hey, Cecil, or Cecil, how have you been, man? Hey, kid, I'm great. How's family and life going? Great, check back. We need an airship. Nice talking to you. Wait, sir, don't go in there. You will pay for this King Love Baron. You haven't seen the last of me. But we're in space now, or the upper atmosphere yet again. I knew Bebe would be unfaithful to me, damn it. You are alone now, and no one can hear you scream. It's time to die. Who the hell said that? I missed something, because the chat is, like, freaking out. I actually did miss something, perhaps. There are gimps? So my story actually begins, and you get to play. Kane Marsh. This is so fucking weird! Oh boy. 
most fun game. Vinny, this is like a 12-year-old's game. Yeah. I was thinking that too, yes. This is made by a kid who's just in the late 90s, early 2000s is just making whatever they like and just being as weird as possible. <laughs> I mean, that's all it is. But yeah, when you have a game that is genuinely as fun as this, you don't mind a little bit of slop and crust on the, you know, on the sides of it. It's <clears throat> real good. It's really? Vinny actually made this and wants to show it off. I made... An RPG, an RPG maker. It should be on the Full Sauce channel where I talk about it and show it off, but I did actually make an RPG. I made a couple. Two. Mine was called Chrono Continuum because I was a big Chrono Trigger fan. <laughs> and it used all the default assets of RPG maker like 2000 and uh, I never got past maybe like 15 minutes or 20 well yeah 20 minutes or so of gameplay I tried it's just it's tough making games all right chat I can't do this anymore I, I, I really just can't do this one I it exists we've seen it good enough Paper Cartman demo. I wonder if this is paper... Good noises! Are you listening, chat? I wonder if this is a um, Paper Mario homage. In no way is Paper Cartman or any explicit... Ga Tool? Wait, 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 that was Lateralis. This is probably also something. <laughs> what song is this? Seether? Well, the quality is so low, you can't even fucking tell. Maybe, I mean, it might still get claimed. It, it could. Every video on Newgrounds was a corn AMV. It was the time of corn. Uh, Vinny, mute. I think I'm going to just take my chances with this one. Because the audio is so crusty. Uh, maybe. Getting some real, like, cinematic shots of Cartman's face, feet. Whose feet is that? Really um, interesting that <laughs> Cartman is this depressed <laughs> over what? <laughs> like, what's happening? Usually he's the devious one. I'm sure people will point to like plenty of episodes where that's not the case, but yeah. Um, uh, I'm just going to keep talking over this. And whatever the case may be, I don't even have any words to say specifically, but just to cover up the song, I'm just going to say words. Oh, that's uh, Cartman's mom. Okay, got it. All right. Just, uh, just watching this. We're really, um, just getting good view of Cartman's eyes. Hmm. A 
So what song is this? I don't know. This is like, <laughs> mom. <laughs> oh no, no. What is that? Is that a gun barrel? Oh God. Th this is like, yeah, this is someone who is like not well, like not doing okay. And they were like, let's just make a South Park fan game. If he smiles, I'm, I'm, I'm out. If he smiles, I'm okay. Paper Cartman. I'm sorry, this is a game? Again. Zelda music. Oh, okay. After that, wow. Tonal whiplash. This is fucking insane. Alright, maybe I'm like overstating it a little bit, but how do you go from that <laughs> to a title screen with Zelda music? Alright. Trying to find a way to start the game. Here we go. Start. The following story may be confusing, for the script is still in development. And more copyright music. Honest to God, Shimmy, the last thing we need to be in a damn prison cell. Easy, Flea. It's all underway. We won't be here long. Who is Shimmy and Flea? I guess we're learning. Oh, this is System of the Down. Okay. Okay, chat. I need to probably find a way now to start muting this i i'm i listen i would love to hear the music that this game is choosing but it's just going it's going hard i'm hoping the audio quality is so terrible that it's not going to like recognize but again sorry johnny if you have to edit this anyway here's the uh, game portion of the game as you can clearly tell. Yep. This character design is excellent. Vin, it would really make my day if you played a game that wasn't terrible. Show up to my streams on a, on a weekday. <laughs> You know, when I'm not banned for Slime Girls. This is Shimmy. I'll keep contact with you by sending text messages. And then this is the gameplay. Oh, he's Paper Cartman. I get it. Is this music? Oh, it's Pokemon. I'm pressing every button, chat, and um, none of the buttons work. Like, none of the buttons work. Check the desk, I'm being told. Okay. I'm clicking, I'm clicking, nothing. Uh, nope. Right mouse click, nope. 
pressed every button on my keyboard. <laughs> Shit. Well, I right clicked as well. I did everything. Yeah, did everything. I tried enter. I tried space. Yeah. <laughs> this is really this is fascinating. Oh, uh, the number. Oh, the numpad. Let's try the numpad. That's a good point. Enter on the numpad. Anything numpad? No, no, nothing. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Was that? Was that Cartman's arm did something? What was that? I'm sorry, I accidentally muted myself while pressing every button trying to figure out how to close that last game. I pressed every button, chat, and you know, it did... It did something, it, it muted me. Anyway, uh, as I said, oh my sweet god, we're, here we are now playing... Kenny Kong Racing. Screw you guys! I'm going home! Yep. I love this. <laughs> the dinosaur gifts! They're so good! You won! You're Kitty Kong Racer. Now you get all of the cheats. Press K S P B to for the cheats. Okay. At least this one wasn't like fucked up. Uh I tried typing the cheats. And, um, nothing's really happening here, so, whatever. Alright. Let's keep going. I mean, this is definitely a, you know, if anything, this is a time capsule. And is historically relevant. Um, it looks like there's a lot of these Kenny's Rampage games, which I'll probably save. Spy 2 Saffron Filter? Oh, Siphon Filter. Moving lines off. I appreciate that option. You know, Private, this biological weapon could cause a lot of devastation. I'm aware of that, sir. I hear it can be programmed by... Com That's correct. I'm no scientist. I can't explain how it works. All I know is the government's given it to us to protect. 
Why would the U.S. want to use such a weapon? Surely it's more suited to terrorists. Imagine a combat situation. Country invades another. We intervene, drop a load of the stuff program, and all attack level beams beings with their choice. The country they have no choice. We win. No one dies if everyone's obedient. Not like dropping a bomb on a city to make them see sense. It's a new type of war in a new millennium. It still sounds pretty nasty. Surely it can be abused, even by us. We could bully other nations with it. Look, this is the United States military private, the most trusted nation in the world. <laughs> that's some two-bit operation. We stand for everything that's good. Maybe so, Sarge. I wonder if this is post-9-11, like just barely. But imagine what could happen if it fell into the wrong hands. John Robson presents <laughs> a game by please say John Robson again please John Robson Scott Ewart. Wow. In association with Andrew Rumney, it's just his friends from school. It's like a bunch of like, <laughs> it's a bunch of like eighth graders. <laughs> Nineteen ninety three somewhere in Baghdad, Iraq. Yo, brought you a beer. Any luck? No, he's still surrounded by his bodyguards. Why is Stan from South Park in Iraq in nineteen ninety three though? You want another beer already? Yeah, that's not why I'm going outside. Be back in a minute. It's Saddam Hussein. Well, now I know why they chose South Park for this topic. That was um, Half-Life Sounds, yeah. Well, Demo Man. Well, problem solved. Stan Marsh has uh, <laughs> taken down Saddam's. Perfect dark music. Wow. Train for missions. Um. Oh boy. So it's a codec, but now it's also Goldeneye. How do you actually select a mission? This, this is very confusing. Let's quit. Oh, okay. Quit. Quit is an interesting button to press to start a game. Uh. Andy, are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay, Andy? Wow, there's a lot of Cartman. <laughs> there's certainly a lot of Cartman here. I... Uh, 
Uh. All right, that's enough of that one. That's enough of that one. Cyborg, did we do Cartman's Quest? I think we did. That one was the, the fucked up one. Alone in the Park? Like Alone in the Dark? This is an insane pack of games. New game. It's like those dinosaur gifts from the Kenny Kong Racing. A lot of times, you would see a lot of the same gifts in, like, Flash games and stuff that you would download, just like little application games. Because it was just like a repository of, like, gifts, and they all had that same moving too fast style. So I wouldn't be surprised if I've seen, like, some of these, like, gifts before. Oops, I think I skipped a cutscene. Well, this has some, like, kind of gameplay. Oh, it's bad. Never mind. And again, I know that these are, like, kids making these games, mostly. But, you know... If you were looking for South Park fan games, you might download all of these before you finally get to one that you like. Um... Yeah, when a zombie gets you, it just you're just frozen. Trying to pick up that. No, no good. Why is it called Alone in the Park when it's parodying Resident Evil? Right? It's a little alone in the dark, no? Would kids have the er knowledge with these early 2000s games? Uh, game making tools, though. I mean, they're trying, clearly. This is also a time where if you found a good Flash game on Newgrounds, you would just play that a lot. And you'd kind of get lucky if there was a good one. Because it wasn't like, there's no Steam. You know, you just kind of have to play all your old games otherwise. Um, and like, finding free games that you could get addicted to and actually in, like enjoy, it was a little bit more rare. Like, for just fan games, or like, people making games in Game Maker. I mean, there were RPG Maker games that ended up... Some got very famous, as you know. But, you know, just whatever you could find that was decent. Well, rest in peace. We'll just stop that there. Cyborg Kenny, since it is getting a little late, we'll just uh, check out some of these super quick. I didn't realize how long this pack of games was going to take. There's kind of a lot of them. Porthole shafted. Um Yeah. Well, let's see. Let's see if if this goes on another I want to get to all of the games in this pack. So yeah, maybe. Maybe Porthole Shafted. It would be, obviously, next week. Uh, but basically, it's just some shitty Amiga games and some good ones, too. That's, it's good, but it... It could wait. Oh. Oh. 
This music also sounds familiar. Also, those stock, like, blood or kill sound effects. Some of them were in Half-Life. This is Sonic Adventure music. Oh. Well, whatever sound effects you could find for your video game, throw them in. Whatever music you can find on, like, a MIDI website, throw it in. Yeah. I did it. <laughs> South Park Omega, uh, Omega Project. My brain is getting very rotten from this game pack. It's gonna be a comet sighting tonight. Would you like to come see it with me, Stan? Omega. <laughs> Stan's gonna be busy. It'll be very romantic, Stan. Damn it. Hmm, that boy is very hot. He is the fabled one, Mistress Wendy. What is this dialogue? What? The one whose love would empower me. What? <laughs> empower me beyond belief. But there is one in your way, Mistress Wendy. Who the hell is that? Yourself from the universe he comes from. Until she is dead, you will not be even able to touch the boy. But don't just stand there. Find the boy and kill the girl. Press enter to accept skill. Press space for next skill. Same sound effect. It's from Counter-Strike. Yeah, all these games have this resolution, but hey, the Mario fan games did too, and those were made within the past 10 years, most of them. This is the game. This is it right here. This is the game, chat. This is the whole game. Wow. Uh, is this another control alt delete? Yes, it is. Stan Pet, we did all these arcadey ones, right? Yeah, we did. South Park Ultimate Pinball. We didn't do that one. I can't even read that, really, but that's fine. Pinball, how bad could it be? Pokemon. It's Pokemon music. What, what is these little fro- are those Jinjos? What's the goal? <laughs> I don't know! <laughs> Get the balls past the living popcorn and the Jinjo heads? It, it seems like it, everything just goes through everything else, so, uh, okay. You, you just, you know, you just listen to the music and you just vibe with it, I guess. That's the whole thing. There's no objectives. <laughs> There's nothing. You just listen and you look. Hey, your score remains if you die. <sighs> okay. And again, there's a series happening here um, called Kenny's Rampage. We have Kenny's Rampage 1, Kenny's Rampage 2, and Kenny's Rampage 4. So, you know, 3 was deemed unworthy. Uh, and I'm just making sure we saw everything else. <gasps> Cook is a basuru. Cook is a basuru. 
Can't even mention it. The beginning of the ongoing series, Kenny's Rampage. Yep. Well, we know what year this is from. We have a definitive year. Warning, extreme violence. Yeah, this, this might not be, um, yeah. Yep, it's one of these. Um, not exactly, I don't think South Park has ever been, like, this, but these kind of tend to show up a lot in the fan games. Like, I don't remember every episode, I know they've covered some heavy topics, and you know, whether or not you like South Park, they do sometimes try to make a point about how some... This, this kind of stuff is bad, okay? But yeah, I mean, this the fan games just, just don't give a shit. It's possible. And I'm not saying South Park has always been satire, because in the early days it was just like anal probes and farts. Uh, um, you know, a good chunk of it was, and Mr. Hanky, the Christmas Pooh. That was the first episode I ever saw. And, um... That said, though, I think if you were, you know, if you're a kid and you're getting... Like, you're making stuff like this, after watching South Park, you may be getting the wrong thing from it. But that's just my opinion. I could be wrong. So, all right, that's Kenny's Rampage 1. Oh, the mouse is stuck. Oh. So, for some re- okay. <laughs> that was amazing. For some reason, um, there were another three Kenny's Rampages. Okay, well, at least they give you a warning. Gamifying satire is a lot harder than violence. Yeah, I mean, but then you, you do have people who make, like, you know, the one where Stan is a Tamagotchi. <laughs> so there is that. And again, there were hundreds of these things that were vetted, or at least it was all pared down a bit. Is this Metallica? Fucking Magus music from Chrono Trigger. Dude! Are you gonna get that far with the song and then not even do the rest of it? <laughs> Excellent audio corruption. Hey Stan, where you been? Where you been, dude? Looking at uh, for Kenny. I need to talk to him about his family. Yeah, he went to Denver for some reason. That experience really screwed up his mind. Denver, ah, oh, crap. I just have this feeling he's gonna do something bad. Didn't his spirit visit him?
crust bus. I think that's an actual like screenshot from the show. Just crusted up really hard by like compression. Cartman, you were pretty quiet during that cutscene. Yeah, the creator of this game couldn't think up any dialogue for me. <laughs> The old fourth wall break trick. I did it too. I listen, I'm just as guilty as this creator because I in my RPG definitely broke the fourth wall a couple times. I thought I was I thought I was being clever. Met the human met the Matt Kennedy's Masterpiece. Kenny's Rampage 2. I would think Matt Kennedy probably went on to make more games that maybe were more Masterpiece-ish. Possibly. I don't know for sure, but it's possible. This offspring. That was necessary. <laughs> that, it's like a Duke Nukem gif. Stan Marsh, right? Why is a kid running this weapon shop? This guy came in here before and said to give you an axe. He also said for you to go to the FP FBPP. He recommended stealing a car. Oh, I see. See those innocent guys on the street? Remember, if you kill them, you'll see some security guards on you. Or get some. Great. You're Stan Marsh, right? You're Stan Marsh, right? Why is there like a crusty stand? Oh, there's mini games. This is his masterpiece. Medic space to shoot. Is that a command and conquer death noise? Excellent, excellent game that is. The one that looks like it would be its own game with some, like, you know, like something different is just doesn't work. Yeah, there's like a small, crusty stand driving those cars. Wow. Hey, bitch, get out of my car. Wait, okay, you can keep the car as long as you do a job for me. Run down the black... Cross gang, they've been doing my wife. They all wear <laughs> red shirts. Also in the glove compartment, you'll find a machine gun. If use it, if you like to get dirty, get to it. Yeah, no, no. Kid enters car, make him gun down people. <laughs> okay, 
Oh, ok. Now, it said to, like, enter the car, but you, there's no button for that. Yeah, they're going mental with the middies in this, at the very least. See, this is nice if they use middies. This is what all fan games should do if they, uh... If they use licensed music in any way, they should just all use middies. building. Chad, I don't think... I think we're good on this one. I, I think this is now just a lot of extra stuff. Uh, that's why we're going to go to Kenny's Rampage 4, Kyle's Journey. Wait, is this a different creator? Nope. It's just someone else presented it. Develop games. You heard them. Go and develop games, everybody. Extremely bloodbath and gore violence. I've never seen it put like that, but that's cool. Dear God. After Stan has get away. <laughs> Dan has don't coming back. I most go for him. Don't worry, Kyle. Hi, coming back soon. You need some sleep. Go to bed, Kyle. Are you kidding me? No, I so worried about, about Kenny. I most look for him. Okay, Kyle, but be careful. I go home, eat my Chia Chessy puffs. <laughs> Goodbye, Kyle. Okay, levy me here, ass master. <laughs> where, where the blood come from? <laughs> Oh my Jesus Christ. Who can do something stupid like this? But where is Kenny? I must find him. I must go to Denver. Oh, this is the true masterpiece of, of the collection. Three hours later. When the fucking bus come. <laughs> it's the same crusty bus. <laughs> He's so small now. <laughs> He's tiny. Was the school bus going to take him to Denver? <laughs> oh, man. How did this get worse? Oh, man. That guy's still dead. Cinema. No. No. No, let me leave. Please, let me leave. No, let me leave. It's just the name of the characters. Oh. Master game. Oh, I think this is... Oh, copyright. 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 Shit, shit. Fuck. Okay. Wow. 
Um, knife. Knife. Denver food. Okay. Shotgun. Hello and welcome. Will you have a weapon? Take this gun and please don't kill Pia Piapol. I hope you have license. <laughs> Hello and welcome. Will you have a weapon? <laughs> Chat, it's, it. it's not, oh, it's another ad for their company. <laughs> TV station. Fruit market train station. A little sock puppet on the TV in the train station? Federal Bureau of Poor People. <laughs> what? What? I didn't know this was a place. I must find a back door somewhere. Hello, have you seen a I gay with hood? Yes, he in the FBPP HQ for two hours ago. Have you seen boy with brown jacket and an axle? <laughs> yes! <laughs> I've heard scream from inside the HQ. <laughs> Do you know a secret back door into the HQ? Yes, go to Cola at Mat and <laughs> shoot it and door will open. Thanks and goodbye. Goodbye. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is... I thought... I thought that this pack was gonna end on a whimper. But I don't know what the fuck this is, and it's ending on something. Anything but a whimper. I just... I don't understand how... Like, was this a different person that made this? I mean, it, I think it might be. I saw a different name. So it might be the same engine. And they just used the same assets and... Just made a different... Yeah, they probably just made a different thing. You didn't finish your mission, how will you end? Suicide, mur murdered, or get away. Okay. Does anyone remember a password? The, like, the most recent password? Anyone paid attention? Shot, shot, oh, cola. No, 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 we're doing uh, copyright music again. Ah, cola. A action. Thank you, chat. You did it. I'll try one more time. Because, yeah, there's no way we're going to be able to do um, Porthole tonight. It's just, it's late. I've been going for like four hours. Uh, next week on twitch.tv slash vine sauce there will be no slimes but there will in fact be porthole and other sunday stream stuff 
I'll also be live during the week with more Castlevania, Aria of Sorrow, Randomized, um, maybe Ultra Kill this week, and whatever other random shit I can think of. Good games, as chat member was hoping for. I will be unbanned on Tuesday, so that is when you will see me stream. Next. I believe. Robocop will be a pre-record. YouTube streams will only be slime from now on. <laughs> I could play Slime Rancher too. I think I got some updates. Barretta Pistol. You didn't finish your mission. How? Okay. What? You know what? That's the perfect end to a game as high quality as this. I mean, that how else would it have ended? You've got different themes here. Look at that. You got themes. Wow. So, uh, so cool. Kenny death montage. Oh my God, they killed Kenny. Oh, okay. oh, 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 oh. You don't understand, chat. Being hey, look, Kenny's okay. 13 and seeing Kenny die every episode was chef's kiss. It was the funniest shit you've ever seen. This is actual show clips. Oh, well, maybe we don't want to show that then. Kenny's diarrhea. This we, we can show. We definitely want to show this. Was this the skibbity toilet of your generation? Yep. Well, there you go. Yeah, that's, that's it. So, again, a time capsule... I think whether or not you like South Park, just seeing what people were making at this time and like how they went about they're making their games in the early 2000s, late 90s, what they used to make them, how they internalized South Park and then translated it into the various things that we just saw tonight. It was fucking bizarre. Um, I mean, I probably played some of this stuff, like maybe a little bit. Regardless, I thought this was fascinating. Uh, not all of it was worth watching or looking at. Definitely not worth playing. But <laughs> but that last game, some some really good dialogue. And that made it all worth it, I think. <sighs> the person who made the pack. Let me get that info real quick, because I'm sure they're going to want credit, credit for this garbage. Um, credits. Um, well, shit. Always, if you make a game pack for me, always put your name in the collection. 
So this is a pack by Rue. And uh didn't it say Rue made some of these or made one of these? I don't know, they have like five different names in their emails, so I, I don't know. <laughs> it's like three different names. But regardless, thank you, Rue, for making this um really interesting collection and uh also it gave me diarrhea. So good enough. There's there's actually they went through the trouble of including important informations. So like each game, I, I didn't see this. Even if it was like a tiny description, there's a couple things here that have different, um, you know, different like uh, informations, cheat codes, and various other things like passwords. So that we could have seen even more. Wow. But anyway, thank you for watching. Let's uh, let's enter the end game of the stream, shall we? I used to own Darth Vader. Sure, Watto. Let's get you to bed. Anyway, chat. Thank you for watching. I, I know this is a, a strange phenomenon. Me streaming on YouTube, as I said earlier. If you didn't catch it. Um, not going to go into the full story again. You've heard it. If not, someone will tell you, or I'm sure you'll find it. But, uh, the band should be up in a couple days. I will very likely be live Tuesday or Wednesday. I'm not sure yet, but Tuesday or Wednesday is a fair assessment. And, uh, I probably will not continue streaming on YouTube. And I also will not be doing a multi-stream because it'll be a hassle. But, uh, yeah, you know, we'll just continue doing streams without slime over the next couple weeks. And that should be fine. Um, on YouTube, there will be pre-records uh, on the Full Sauce channel. Just Vine Sauce Full Sauce. I'm working through Robocop. I've got that Dot Age game been working through. Plenty of other shit. Some good indie games that I haven't um, checked out yet. And... Um, yeah, on, on Twitch, when I return, we'll just continue the Castlevania Randomizer and uh, Ultra Kill. And then I'm going to start thinking about some slightly longer form stuff until Final Fantasy VII Rebirth comes out. So, yeah, once again, thank you, everybody that spent a couple bucks to get your message ignored. Uh, very cool. That's Sorry, I just don't spend the time reading messages. <laughs> Or, it's just not my style, but I appreciate the support. It's really nice of you. And I hope you have a great night. And thank you again for... Um, listen, whether or not you think the ban was deserved, here's a, here's a little hint. It wasn't for seven days. It happened. You don't need to get upset on my behalf. It'll be over soon. At the very least, with Twitch, I can speak to human beings. On YouTube, I don't think I've ever seen a human being that worked at YouTube, like ever. So, at the very least, I can, you know, get back to Twitch and uh, go through their bullshit. Pick your poison, really. So, yeah. Stream over. See you. Good night. Thank you all very much. And mods, thank you too. I cannot do this without my mods and the vetting team. And even the viewers that submit the various Sunday stream packs. Vinesauce.email. Go to that website. Fill out the contact form if you have any ideas for a pack or if you want to make one. Uh, and, you know, maybe you'll see it. Could be fun. Appreciate you. Take care. Good night. Here we go! Yahoo!